Assalamu alaikum friends and family. It's Ruben here from my Shakhar Bagan in Birmingham. I'm here to share a new video with everybody. Um, we're coming towards the end of our, our harvest season. Uh, we've had a wonderful year. Hope everybody who has joined me for my videos enjoyed everything that we've showed and the hints and tips um, have been helpful and useful. I think for everybody uh, this year, everyone started to harvest the last few vegetables from their garden and now is the perfect time to start thinking about um, 2021 or if you're, do, if you're going to be doing any winter gardening start to sow some seeds um, hopefully I'll be doing some so I'll be sharing some videos with you throughout the winter um, but today I'm going to start harvesting um, the things that I've got left in my garden um, we're really blessed because we've got loads and loads of vegetables and bottle gourds and khudu left to harvest naga in the greenhouse here we've got a, a red amaranth and uh, the, the dugi we've got loads and loads of pumpkins and different varieties to to showcase we've got some lab lab um, Bangladeshi uri to harvest as well so it's going to be one of the biggest harvests that I've done this year um, because we'll be harvesting things from both gardens here um, so hopefully you'll join me and you'll enjoy this video so we'll, we'll hopefully uh, get through as much as we can um, but stay with us if you enjoy it please like and subscribe that really helps us a lot and if you've got any questions at all please add them to the comments I respond to every single comment um, no matter what it, what topic I'll come back to you as soon as I can normally within a day uh, but hopefully you'll enjoy and, and you have enjoyed all the videos we've posted this year so far and um, support us as much as you can um, watch our videos and then it'll help us uh, post more and more uh, towards the end of this um, season and into the next, hopefully. So hopefully you enjoy it and um, we'll get started now. Okay guys, so I'm going to harvest some Bangladeshi Uri. It's a special bean um, known as Lab Lab. And as you can see on this plant, we have harvested bean from this plant already before. But with what's left, you can see... How wonderful is that? And it's about the same on the other side as well. So we're going to start harvesting these. But really quickly, I just want to show you this chilli plant again. How amazing does this look? Look at that for a chilli. Um, I will be keeping some seeds. Look at the size of that. This is a black chilli. Um, Usually, when I've grown them in the past, they've they've been they've been this size. This year, they've been this size. So I'll be saving seeds um, towards the bottom. If there's enough time. I'll do a very different video for you guys soon uh, around seed seed saving and preparing for 2021. So remember to subscribe so you can watch those videos. It's going to be really useful for everybody. But anyone who's around the Birmingham area, when I save some seeds from this plant, you're more than welcome to them free of charge. More than happy to share seeds. Um, so yeah, so we're going to st start off um, by harvesting some of these beans. Um, I know loads of people. These are really expensive in the shops as well for people um, who buy them. So it's really great to be able to harvest these and um, enjoy them. And we can eat them with fish, meat, just in mixed vegetable, curries. Um, I'm going to leave some of the smaller ones. Um, I'm going to leave some for seed as well. Because these ones, when you know you've got some um, that, that are doing really, really well. Uh, and a plant that's done well. I, you've heard some of my videos, I call some certain plants miracle plants. Because certain plants I just keep giving and giving and giving. Um, this is one of them, but as you can see, even in the, all the kind of low temperatures we've got now, we've still got flowers coming out. Um, and if, if we get a bit of sun, um, they'll get pollinated and we can enjoy those as well. But, oops, I'll pick that up in a bit. Um, I'll, I'll be keeping these ones for seed, so you can see inside there's some seed already. So I will not take them off. Um, this one can come off. Um, but I've made the mistake before um, of taking the wrong ones off, so I'm going to try my best to concentrate. Um, 
already there. This is just from three plants, and I've got got plants there and at the back of the of the garden there to harvest and the one one there as well. So we'll have a decent harvest. I won't be taking all of them off in one go um, because there's no, nothing beats um, taking it off fresh and then eating it. Um, I'll take this one off at the top. Okay, so hopefully you're enjoying that. Let me just get the rest harvested now and then I'll just show you the result. Just wanted to show you how lovely does this look. So this is just one branch. Really great. So I'm going to still har continue to harvest. Um, as I'm taking them off, just putting them into this container. Um, so yeah, I'm just going to keep going. Okay, so I've finished the three plants um, and you can see how many we've got here. It's quite a lot, isn't it? Done really well and that's just from three plants and the second harvest from those plants. Um, so I'm going to move on to this plant here. Um, it's not as done as, as well as the other ones but there's a few on here that I'll take off and then I've got to get on a ladder again to take some off from the top. So let me harvest those right now. So this uh, plant here, or a couple of plants that I've got, are, are traditional Bangladeshi already. So they, they don't have the purple um, flowers, they have white flowers. So I'll show you that when I get on top in a bit, but we actually managed to have a few. How amazing is that? I've kept the first three that came out for seed. Um, so you can see. Um, and a lot of people you'll know when you grow these, so many people have said, oh, I've got so much leaves and no flowers. It's because it's a proper Bangladeshi uri plant and the climate's not ideal for it. Um, but only a few people that I know um, have managed to get flowers. Um, so we've got some beans on there and I kept those for seed. But hopefully, if you look on top, um, I don't know if you can tell because of the lighting, but we've got loads of flowers that have now appeared. And um, the uri, so these are the proper Bangladeshi ones. Uh, we don't always get them here and they don't always grow but um, we've got the flowers that have appeared right at the top and um, so that'll be fun if they if we get a, a few more days of warm weather um, it'll be great to get a few of the proper Bangladeshi ones but I'm still harvesting so keep stay with me so I've moved on to another plant now so this one again has done excellent so this is the second time we've harvested from this plant here so it goes right to the top loads of flowers left so yeah, so I'll harvest these um, now as well. I'm not saving any seeds from this one because I've got plenty of these seeds now from the other plant. Um, so yeah, we'll keep harvesting. So I'll keep going, I'll get all of these off and then we'll move on to the final plant. Okay, so I've really enjoyed that. So I've just finished harvesting um, another plant. You can see how well we've done. And it's not a small container, so um, you can see there's a lot of wood here. I've still got one more plant to do, um, but hopefully you've enjoyed that. I'm just going to move on to the last plant now, but we've done really well. And um, we had some surprise ones inside the plant as well. There's a lot more, I think, in terms of tips, when you grow these, uh, keep them in, a, in an area that's protected from the wind. As long as you do that and it does get a bit of sunshine, you'll be absolutely fine. So now I'm in the pumpkin area of the garden. Um, but here, I've grown a few woody plants um, some have done you can see done better than others um, but yeah a few already to take off from here and then we're done uh, for the uri for this year okay so that's the last of the uri hopefully that will balance there it's fine so that, hopefully you've enjoyed that everybody that's been an epic um, uri harvest this year really happy with that it's probably about three three four curries worth in there um, in terms of kg yeah a couple of couple of kg probably if not a bit more so really happy with that um, we'll continue harvesting things to end the summer and then we'll move on to winter gardening so yeah hopefully you've enjoyed that <laughs>